how's it going? Welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy. Okay, so I can't fully remember where we left off at. I've been doing a lot of side quests because they're all locked till I level up. So I've been doing that off camera. But anyways, we're back in the main story. Here we go. Welcome, everyone. I see you've already met some of the many beasts we study in this class. Though be advised, none of these creatures should be taken lightly. They are all in their own way dangerous, especially if one does not know how to handle them properly. Now, it seems many of you are out of practice. Let's take some time to review the basics of how to care for a beast, shall we? Miss Sweeting, would you please assist our new student with the lesson today? Yes, Professor Howen. Hello, I'm Poppy, Poppy Sweeting. Don't worry about Professor Howen's speech. She over-exaggerates sometimes. <laughs> All the beasts in class are perfectly safe. Oh! Miss Sweeting, pay attention, please. The tongue of a puffskin can be a slippery devil. Uh, yes, Professor. Here. You can practice on Gerald. Just keep an eye out for his tongue. <laughs> you can use my brush. Just be gentle. Oh, and think pleasant thoughts. I like to think it enriches his experience. So... Oh, uh, you gotta... That's lovely. I'm sure he feels much better. I think he might be hungry. Would you mind giving him some beast feed? Okay, so we just gotta feed it now. No? Okay. What do you suppose the pellets taste like to Gerald? Pudding, I like to think. <laughs> I think we can safely say that Gerald likes you. That's good news. He seems very nice. He is. Kindness is one of his best qualities, right after ambition and cleanliness. Good work, everyone. Now, let's make our way to the pens and select another beast. And please, do be careful as you feed and groom them. Miss Sweeting, why don't you show our new student to the measles in the farthest pen? This way. The measles are over here. Okay. Oh, couple of measle whiskers ought to get me a few canuts at least. Enough to buy something from Honey Jukes. <laughs> Stupid thing. Oh. Tus Tus Peculiar Poppy. Worried about a worthless little rodent? Her name is Persephone! <laughs> Her name is Persephone! <laughs> That's really not funny. <sighs> Let's go. Those two don't belong anywhere near this class. Poachers in training. Persephone was on to them. Okay, so... Thank you for your help. Let's carry on. Feed and brush the measles just as you did with Gerald. Now it's ready. <laughs> Why he does really that? They know a good egg when they see one. As do I. It appears our time has come to an end. Please close the pens and see yourselves out. Now, where is our new student? Ah, there you are. Where I would are you? like a uh... moment, please. Hello, Professor. You wanted to speak with me? I did. How did you find your first beast's lesson? 
It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. Good. You seem to understand that when beasts are properly controlled, they can play a vital role in our lives. Some provide us with magically imbued materials, if cared for correctly, which does not include torturing them for whiskers. Well done, by the way. Probably best to let me handle it next time. Yes, Professor. They're nearly as bad as the savagers in Rookwood's poacher pack. Sadly, we're the ones who suffer, stumbling over dead beasts. Terrible waste of resources. Surely the poachers can be brought to justice by someone. The Ministry, perhaps? Hmm. An optimistic idea. Now, why don't we focus on more immediate matters that we can control? Professor Weasley has asked that I prepare some assignments designed to help you catch up to the other fifth years. Be on the lookout for my owl. Meanwhile, I also encourage you to study as many beasts as you can on your own time. Psst, psst, over here. What? Where are I? I'm a hero. At least it tells me. Do you need something, Poppy? Thank you again for saying something to those brutes so that I didn't have to. You were an augury at noon in the desert. I certainly hope that's a good thing. It's something my gran and I say. It means that something or someone is a welcome surprise. At least that's what we decided it meant. I couldn't stand there and watch them harm the poor thing. We're of a similar mind. Actually, in light of that, there's someone I'd like you to meet in the forest. I'm not sure. What's this all about? You'll see. I promise you have nothing to fear. I wouldn't right. take just anyone there. In fact, you're the first. Really? Well, thank you, I think. As I said, we think alike. Pleasant surprise. I'm actually kind of curious. Quite the weather we're having, don't you think? Poppy, where are you like taking? a giant? It really is much better if I just show you. Don't worry, we're nearly there. It's just ahead. No. Definitely not a giant. Stand back. Oh, Buckbeak. That's probably not his name, but... I forget what these things are called. Isn't she just magnificent? Go on, introduce yourself to her, but be careful. You must always show hippogriffs the proper courtesy before you approach them. someone this quickly. You can feed and brush her if you'd like. I come and check on her every once in a while. Bring her pasties, tell her what's going on in the castle. You wouldn't know from looking at her, but she's a dreadful busybody. There we go. What did you think of High Wing? I thought she was brilliant. Can't believe you introduced me to her. I suspected you two might get along. Are you the reason students have been seeing hippogriffs flying above the Forbidden Forest? Hmm, perhaps. Did you know that once you earn a hippogriff's trust, they'll always be there for you? 
I've seen it firsthand with her. How exactly did you and Highwing cross paths? It's a longer story, but I rescued her from poachers a few years back. Got her to safety and, well, she was fine until recently. You may have noticed that poachers are something of a problem in the area, so I worry they could get her again, and that I might not be there next time. Professor Howen mentioned the poachers as well. She seems to imply that we couldn't rely on the Ministry to help. I don't often agree with Professor Howen, but on that, I fear she's right. The poachers' influence is growing. I see them every day in the village, lingering, talking to people. They're up to something. I'm just not sure what. That does Let's seem do strange. This. Sounds as if they're planning something. Exactly. I think I'm going to look into it. Find out what's going on. What they're doing. I think that's a fine idea. Information is power. And the more I know, the better I can keep Highwing safe. You seem undeterred. Will you let me know what you find out? Oh, very well. I will. I should be going, but we'll speak again soon, I hope. Alright, first things first, I'm unequipping this. Or maybe not, maybe that wasn't equipped. Revelio. Okay. So let's get these back in here. I don't know why, I guess this is going to be my hand for that one. Okay. Let's see some more quests. Fire and use a focus potion. So we don't, I don't think I have any money. 138. Sell value 90. Let's see, anything I can sell? Really not, no. So let's go back to gear. I could sell that. 90, 60. So what I'm going to have to do to continue all of the story is go to map. Just scavenge, really. Friles of Merlin. Okay, that could be next. Okay. So. Let's see if there's anything more closer, because I don't want to go that far out. At least not yet. Here we are. Appearances. I'm trying to do something where I can actually get money. <laughs> but, whatever. Okay, here we go. Hard away. I do like how it's cool that you can fly. This could away. prove dangerous if I'm not careful. Okay. I wonder who lives here. I never thought Ramrock's loyalists would- Pardon me, is everything all right? Hardly. I've just lost my business and almost my life. You'd best look elsewhere for wares. I've nothing to sell now. I never thought it'd come to this. 
Be on your guard. Ramrock and his loyalists will spare no one. They attacked you. Oh, Ramrock has no patience for goblins who won't join him. While I too would like to see goblin kind treated by wizards as equals, bloodshed is not the answer. When I said as much, they turned on me, struck me till I nearly passed out. Took my carts, my belongings, even that which is most precious to me, my paintings. I'm sorry this happened to you. I shall certainly keep an eye out for your carts. That is very kind of you, but I think they took them to their camp southwest of here, just past some ruins. Too dangerous to try and retrieve them. I did enchant the carts to return to me if I ever lost them, however. Slim though the chances may be, I'm holding out hope that some of what was taken is returned to me. It was nice meeting you. I wish it had been under better circumstances. After what Ranrock did to oh. that goblin banker at Gringotts, I shouldn't be surprised at what happened to Arn. Goblin camp. Past the ruins. I'm on the right track. An encampment. This must be it. Arn will regret not joining us. If he doesn't come round oh, now, shit. he'll be made even more of an example. There's too many of them, from what I'm seeing. I'm gonna get this one on the high ground. I'll take them all. Run the other way when they see me, humans do. Every time. What's that? Aha! There you are! Protego! Stupid! You're the coward! <laughs> no, 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 I didn't want to go down the ladder. Expelliarmus! Incendio! Accio! Stupid! That stupid defeated our Oh shit, I need to do that. Can't handle a little altercation. Huh? Uh, yeah. Expelliarmus. Yeah. Uh, Accio. Send it. Protego. Why is that? Longer than necessary. Good for you. Expelliarmus. Time. You won't get away with that. Made you do like a bunch of side stories to like actually it's go on the and make story. That is smart. Incendio. 
I won't rest. Okay, a few of these sound like Mark Campbell. Stupid child. I hear. Oh. Oh, just here. Oh, don't cut me off. Let me kill your friend so first. More than one way to enter. Collect, collect. I want to collect this. Oh, there we go. Easily diverted. Incendio! Rodrigo! Look to that! Akio! Confirm! Absolutely thinking for this play! A mystery! Someone thinks they can outlast me! That was unimpressive! Akio! Uh, 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 uh. What are you doing? What are you doing? Expelliarmus. That much more well. Uh, oh. Could it be? One. Not your best moment, I fear. Akio. Oh. 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 this I don't know what that did but okay free the carts okay this part wouldn't be it Parts. So has to be in here. Yep. Quite an enchantment. The carts are returning to on. Okay. Should be coming up on here soon. Just gonna go through the trees. Okay, we'll slowly go down. Should be up here he is. I have good news. Your carts are on their way back. I don't, I don't know what to say. Any hope I have of getting my belongings back was quickly fading. Ramrock's lot called me a fool for believing in the good and wizard kind. Thank you for proving them wrong. I managed to free your carts fairly easily. Oh, I'm glad you're all right. Oh, I can't wait to have my things back, especially my paints. <gasps> you know... You've inspired me. I've been dealing with witches and wizards for years, and we've always got along just fine. Perhaps my next piece will be a tribute to all that is good between us. What a nice idea, Ron. I wish you luck with it. Oh, I can't wait to get started. Uh, thank you again for all you've done. Oh, 
Okay. All the best to you. Once my... So for the next mission, I don't know what I need to be. Let's see. So I need to learn the long harma and the pulse. So I need to acquire a focus potion. I need like a thousand for that. So I'll get to work on that. Till then, peace out.